So today I'm doing another AliExpress haul, but it's not just an AliExpress haul. I thought it may be useful if I like kind of gave you updates on some of the products that I bought from AliExpress because I think sometimes, you know, when you're just kind of doing a haul and you're showing like, this is what I got, I got this, I got this, that's fantastic. But it's all so interesting to get like mini reviews or just to know, well, what did you think of that? Did you like it or was it terrible? what did you think you know you left in suspense a bit so today i thought i'd just show you like a handful of products that i've just bought and then at the end i'll give you like little updates on some of the other items that i've bought and shown in previous hauls so i don't know if that would be something that you'd be interested in seeing but she's doing it anyway so i don't know that's what we're doing let's jump in the first product I'm going to mention that I bought is this top. I mean, I just love this top. This is just like, I love it. Like, I love it. It's that kind of almost like, it feels like super soft. I don't know why I'm coming close as if you can suddenly feel it, but it, like, it almost feels like, you know, swimming costume kind of material. Uh, that's kind of what it feels like. It's just really like, um what's the word like slippery i just have no idea but as you can see it's like a camo like design and you know i mean i'm the biggest fan ever of this uh baseball like design of a top like i live in these baseball kind of tops like permanently oh, like a while ago and i forgot to bring it up in a haul but i bought this one here which is exactly the same but instead of having like pink and gray it's got like you know more of like a typical like khaki and uh gray and black camo design on the sleeves i love them both like just to give you an update on this one i love this and you'll will have seen this in other videos that i've done if you've watched my channel before and i also love my new one so yeah i think that these are fabulous i think that they're only about five pounds and i'm definitely going to go back on and buy another one so i have them both in the size small and this one feels like a little bit like big on me not like hugely big but big big whereas this one again is small but this actually feels like it's smaller so they're kind of like different sizes in a way even though they're both small i know really how rude or oh, this which reminded me a lot of the uh, christian Louboutin, like ridiculously overpriced uh, lip glosses i just got this purely because i wanted to like just see what it looked like really and i must say it looks pretty convincing really it do i've never seen the real louboutin louboutin whatever it is i've never seen one of those in person because i'm not fancy enough to you know mix with people that actually have the genuine article nice it was a couple of pounds i have tested this out and it's actually a really nice kind of lip gloss um it's got a little like doe footy kind of um it looks like a golf club doesn't it really you know like i don't know you could just go golfing if if you forget your golf club just bring this and say it's fine i'm covered i have this it may be a bit small but i think i can manage somehow uh, this is really cute and i really like it the actual product is really really quite nice a little swatch just in case you do want to see i mean it's just very you know unique really which is what attracted me to it look at that it's got like this little stringy bit here so you know you can kind of tie it around your neck and i mean this could be like i don't know could be just like a funky necklace really if you wanted it to you know if you're going out for a very important dinner this could be your necklace and no one would think that that was strange at all next i picked up this watch this was only a couple of pounds and i have not really had the best of luck with watches from aliexpress because uh, they always seem to break on me um, but then again they are so cheap so there is no surprise with that story i just really like the look of this one i'm a sh always a huge fan of pink and black can you tell and i like the fact that this kind of you know the watch fronty bit what do you call that the head of the watch the watch dial the watch i don't know i'm sure that this bit has a name but i know nothing about watches same i know nothing about bags so i don't know do i actually have to buy batteries for this thing i don't know I'm definitely, well, I'm definitely not going to be buying batteries for this, but I mean, it looks pretty. So, you know, I've been known in the past to wear a watch that doesn't work 
purely because you know it looks pretty so the next uh, thing I got ages ago look at this it's an ice cream bag and I mean really I don't need to explain why I just think this is so cute because just look at it look 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 at this it is super 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 cute I actually got this at the same time that I got my monster handbag that I showed in my first haul I'll link all my hauls below if you're interested a novelty bag it's not like a take me seriously kind of bag like I don't think I'll be bringing this into the office anytime soon uh, just because I I don't know really um, yeah but I, I love it I mean I think Honey is, is a little bit embarrassed of this bag I know when we went to Pizza Hut one time I brought this bag along with me Honey's was kind of like walking a few steps in front of me and he, he was just acting like he didn't know me and I think that that's rather unfair because I don't think this bag is that embarrassing really um, the boys love it, it's got a nice little compartment there hello, I'm not embarrassing am I? not one bit, no but anyway, so I love the chain as well on this it, you know me and bag descriptions I don't know it's just a chain look at it look 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 this is just really pretty I think it's really pretty okay so that's my bag so I did recently show this on snapchat and I don't know what's happened to it because it's got black on it and I don't know where that black came from I actually got three of these you may be asking yourself Adwin why are you buying lollipops all the way from China it's not a lollipop this is meant to be like a beauty blender I know I'm, I'm gonna let that sink in I'm leaving the thought with you just for a split second this is meant to be a beauty blender on a stick flailing around like that there were three of these the boys took the other two and I don't know they just became like toys the idea of this is you hold on to it and you just simply just apply your foundation to your face like this and it just goes on perfectly and you know why is it why is everyone not using this like really it, I mean this is never going to work I don't think it's ever going to work I was going to do a first impression on it but then I just thought that's going to be the shortest first impression ever because look you have no control over it I mean unless I hold it there but still you have no control over what's going on and because you're it's like on a stick you just don't put any real pressure onto your face like seriously I just no just just no I mean it was only about 30 people don't waste your money on that I mean really I I no no so next I bought a fake this is the um fake master palette by Mario um ABH now you if you well if you've watched my kind of Aliexpress hauls before or if you've watched some of my other videos you'll know that I don't agree with fake makeup however I like to test it out because I'm just like really intrigued by it and also I think it's important that and I always sound like really cringy now at this point but and I know it sounds overly dramatic but I like to kind of expose it and keep in the forefront of people's minds that there's lots of fakes out there and they're very convincing I know I've said this a million times before and I feel like I always do have to like justify why I buy fake makeup it's just because I just know that there's so much fake stuff flying about Amazon eBay I think on Aliexpress people kind of approach it knowing that the fake makeup is fake because it's so cheap however I believe that on eBay they sell fakes for like sometimes even more than the like RRP price so I don't know I just like to kind of expose it and raise people's awareness like some kind of crusader she is a crusader you know other people are feminists some other people are vegans and you know I'm just all over here like yeah I'm a fake makeup crusader that's me I should get a t-shirt I say no and then on the back to fake makeup I don't know what do you think should I get that started into production I mean really anyway so I'm gonna give this one a go uh, possibly if anyone's interested in seeing it maybe I don't know um, it does look pretty kind of similar to the genuine article but you know the proof will be on the eyes and in terms of like the outside packaging it does look like super 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 convincing so yeah I will do like a first impression review on this if you're interested if you're not interested I won't do it I'll just 
finger about with it myself. Which again, that sounds wrong. It sounds wrong. Anyway, forget I said that. Okay, so that's it for like my haul, but I just want to just get on to just a couple of updates for you. So I mentioned this skirt in my last haul. I picked up this one and also like a smoky charcoal grey kind of one. <gasps> Let me just tell you, I love these skirts. I wear the smoky charcoal grey one so much. Like, I wear it too much. Like, sometimes I wear it, like, three days in a row at work. And, you know, that's a bit skanky, really, isn't it? But I just do because it's so comfortable. These, I think they only come in, like, one size. But because of the type of, like, material they are, they're super stretchy. They're so comfortable. You know, like, if you've had a big lunch and sometimes, like, you get a bit bloated and then you sat there, particularly if you're working, like, an office, and then you have to sit there for the rest of the day with, like, your stomach, like, and you feel all, like, I ate too much. Well, this skirt never leaves you feeling that way because it stretches with your tummy so I mean that's just perfect for me love 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 these so much so that I bought two more look can you see the string in my face that why am I even holding it am I why are you even holding it up in the air like that I mean really come on now uh yeah so I bought two more of these I got a red one and I got another smoky charcoal gray one so that at least I can like wear like one that might not be so dirty I mean not that they're dirty I never wear dirty clothes she says glancing down at her um leggings which have a bit of makeup on them but do you know what I mean you know what I mean okay so the other thing that I really wanted to update you on was these mermaid makeup brushes I adore these like I think they are so good not only do they look like super super pretty but they actually are practical they're so soft and I'm always mentioning this one on my snapchat because this is one of my favorite brushes it's just so soft and this is the perfect powder brush or um bronzer brush just because you can just really get it in there and get it all over the face I love these brushes. If there was one light set of brushes I would really encourage you to buy, it would be these ones because they're just so soft, so affordable and like I love them. I love them. If someone like sold me these and said these are Tom Ford's own brushes, I would say I believe you because they're so soft. I mean, I wouldn't question it. I may question it. I would question it actually, but you know what I mean. The next product to update you on was the Nubian 2 palette. I Oh God, here we go again with the ice cream situation. I know that not everyone that kind of watches my AliExpress hauls will watch my kind of more makeup related uh, content. So just in case you've not seen it, I did do a kind of review of the fake, fake Nubian um, 2 palette. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, like literally, and everyone always asks me, Amwin, where did you get it from, which seller? I can't say. What I will say though, and I checked just before filming, if you search for Nubian, you will find this palette. Like it's still there, they've got the Nubian one, which, I, which I've just ordered as well. And I know earlier, like I sound so contradictory right now because I was saying about the fake makeup and I don't agree with it. This is so good though. This is so good and part of me believes it may be real. I know it's not, but part of me believes it is just because it's made in China. I don't know. I don't know. The real one's made in China. This is made in China. This is brilliant. This just turns me blue. Like, look at this. It's like it sucked the life out of my face. Really, look at this. Like, she, she's had the life sucked out of her. Okay, so I also hauled this little 3D uh, shimmer stick in my last... Um, Paulette and I really like this like I've tried it a few times and it's really actually quite nice on the face it just gives you like a wet look sheen it doesn't really have much in the the way of like I don't know it's not like super like glowy but if you're looking for something that's just going to make your skin look a little bit more kind of dewy then this actually is a really good one to go for and it's not that expensive at all also i have filmed a kind of review of the two faced little black book of bronzes this is not like obviously a real one it's fake that review is going to be coming very soon okay, so that's it i think for my kind of aliexpress haul number four and also like a few little updates along the way of previous things that I've hauled if you enjoyed it let me know down below and yeah I will be back soon I'm sure with more hauls because I am currently waiting for so many things from Aliexpress so there's going to be more hauls coming up soon I thank you so much for watching and I'll be back soon with more stuff just stuff
lots of stuff. I never know how to end videos, so I'm just, I go off on an awkward rant. I'm going to go now. Bye.